everyone. Welcome to Roger Paul Channel. The next Nebiru update. Skies are changing. Look at that right there. As you can see, uh, Skippy is also out here. See there? Chem Trail. System Trail. Right here. System Trail there. Chem Trail going there. Another one looks like right in here. But uh, look at the detail in that, folks. Ooh, look at this. Ooh, look right there. Whoa. It's kind of weird. But, uh, folks, I'm thinking about changing the channel name. Ooh, look right there. I got little, you know, stripes there and there. It's probably why they chemtrailed it right there. There's, yeah, that's like a. No. That is not a chemtrail right there. That right there is a chemtrail going diagonal. But that right there looks like a cross. That is not a chemtrail. That's part of a system trail. Wow. Huh. A cross. But uh, as we look at this though, look here how it's like rounded right here. See that? It looks darker right in here. And then it's rounded. That's kind of weird. But anyway, folks, I'm thinking about changing the channel name uh, from Roger Paul to Hillbilly Sky Watching. <laughs> so, what do y'all think about that? Um, I'm also going to change the icon. The icon is right here. See it? So, you know, what do y'all think of that? Just want something new, you know what I mean? So, look at the detail in all this. It's not just clouds, it is also system trails. As these objects get closer, it's going to press on our atmosphere anyway and cause disruption in the atmosphere. You know, disturbances. Look at that, Skippy again. I wonder how close I can get to him. Look at that. Not bad. That's... Looks like he's throwing down a contrail there. Ooh, look at this. This here is all going into something over here. Here, let's go up front here and look. Well, by the way, that's the south. That's the east. Look at the red glow. Clouds are kind of pinkish and purple and just little different colors. You know, we'll, we'll see many more intense colors. Skippy was right here. That's, them clouds are disappearing. They always disappear around sunset. You notice that? It seems like the clouds will be out. They'll be white and you see them. And then around sunset, a lot of them will, they don't just disappear, they fade. They're still there, you know, they're just, you can see through them. But after the sun sets, you see them again. You know, they come back, and that's weird. I've been watching that for, uh, I've been watching that right here from my driveway since 2018. Look, Skippy again, right there. Now, look at, there's another one right there. There's one, and right there's one. Let me zoom in on him so you can see him a little better. See? There's one. Here, I'll, I'll get him. There he is, right there. There's another one. See there? So there's two. They're getting ready to lay down chemtrails is what they're doing. So, got to be hiding something today, that's for sure. But, uh, folks, you know I got to, but, um, we got to get right. You know, we got to prepare. You know, the U.S. economy ain't doing very good. The U.S. dollar is going down. You know, China, Russia, India, South Africa, and France now, I believe, they're going to take out the, the dollar. 
You know, which means our prices will go up even more than they already are. So folks, you might want to get stocked up on things. Between the trees, Skippy was, he's another chemtrail. So you might want to stock up on things, folks. You know, not just food, medicines, uh, guns and ammunition too, because they're going to take out the AK-47. They're, they're going to make that where it's almost illegal to own it. So you might want to, you know, think about doing something on that. So, and it just, this world's going crazy, folks. You know, people is getting just hateful and just hating their heart and just, they stay angry for, you know, this, I mean, I mean, we all know someone that stays angry all the time, but it seems like a lot of people are staying angry all the time for no reason. You know, the angry person, though, they feel like they got to be angry, but they don't. They do not have to be angry. They just need to develop patience. You know, I wasn't a very angry person. Excuse me. Just took a drink of water. Um, I used to be very angry back in 2010. I hated everybody. Look at the detail in this, folks. And the clouds. You know, but anyway, I hated everyone. You know, I mean, I wasn't prejudiced. I wasn't racist. I hated everyone equal. And... You know, I just turned my life over. Skippy again. See him? Right there. Right in there. See the line? And uh, anyway, but I changed. You know, and I prayed for years that God gives me patience. Without realizing, with patience comes tribulation. So I went through a lot. And now I am very patient. If you notice, look at the clouds. How it's going here. You know, that's like a mess right in there. And then we got it like here. See it? And then it's like a round spot right there where there's nothing. Isn't that something? Look at that. But they all seem to be going in here. Just notice that. See there? And it looks like a ball right there. See it? And, uh, but yeah, people's getting crazy. And you know, that's going to be our worst, that's going to be our main enemy, is other people. When everything starts breaking down, you know, and, I mean, I'm getting ready to fix my house up. And uh, we're moving. Look, blue cloud. You should only see that in very extreme cold weather. That's the only time you should see blue clouds. Wait a minute. Here, let me cross the road here. There's the north. Look at that. System trails. You know? Look at this. Look how that goes towards the north here. Well, past the tree. Goes to the north. Goes all the way over here. Stops right here where I said there. It looks circled with nothing. See there? Look at that. And look at the colors. Blue clouds. We're not supposed to see blue clouds here in uh, Ohio. Usually in the, like a north or south pole is where you see the blue clouds. So that's where they're supposed to be. They're not supposed to be here. And, uh, well, anyway, we're wanting, uh, you know, I'm, you know, I mean, you're all aware that we had a water leak. And by the time I figured it out where it was, you know, I mean, to be honest, look, I'll, I'll be honest. I thought our dog was peeing on the floor, you know, because they dug a hole in the, um, and the floor, you know, there's a subfloor down and dug a hole to the subfloor. Well, we thought that, you know, we have, you know, three dogs. So we thought the dog, two dogs or males, we thought they was peeing in the same little hole. Well, come find out it was a water leak. And after I fixed it, the, uh, the floor started bubbling and sinking down, you know, so I'm redoing the kitchen floor. I'm redoing um, putting a whole new floor down, kitchen, living room, put, you know, I put carpet in the uh, two bedrooms, and I'm getting ready to put it in ours, and mine, so, uh, then after that, we're going to paint it, clean up the yard, you know, the back, because we've been here for, you know, dang nigh 12 years, so, yeah, we got stuff, you know, I got stuff on the back patio, so, uh, anyway, I'm going to clean it up, then we're going to put it on the market, you know, for about 30000 
you know, or 35, you know, let them talk us down to 30. You know what I'm saying? Here, let's go look at the east again. You're going to be surprised what we see back there. Look at this. Wow. And, uh, well, anyway, after we sell it, you know, after we sell it, I'm thinking about just splitting the money with the wife and leaving. You know, but that, you know, that's what I'm thinking about. But, you know, time will tell. Whoa, look at this now, folks. You know what I'm saying? And, uh, look at this. Wow. Wait a minute. Okay, look here, guys. This here goes here, goes this way. And then it comes, you know, around this way. Goes all the way over to exactly that spot right there in the southeast. See that? That's weird. But anyway, you know, I want to sell this place. And go out in the country where there's no one. Absolutely no one. My closest neighbor, hopefully, is a mile or more up the road. You know, and... I'll go to the Rockies if I have to. I want seclusion. You know, I want absolute quiet. It's not really absolute quiet. You know, I mean, even, you see, I bought this place as a stepping stone anyway. You know, everybody needs stepping stone. You know, figure we'll buy it. You know, it's just rent payments. You know, rent to own. We finally own it. So we figure, you know, I figure fix it, sell it. That way I've got, you know... You know a chunk of money to put you know buy another or even some land you know buy some land and uh live in a camper until i get a cabin built you know use the wood off the land for the cabin that's what i'm thinking you know i can do it look at this right here folks look at that right there see there how it's rounded dark that's what I call a dark spherical shape. What some people call shadow objects. You know, so... But, uh... Well, I don't know. What do you think, folks? Think I should sell or stay? You know, so... But, we're well, actually, we're def I'm definitely going to sell. As soon as this place is fixed and I want to be... Mo I want to be... I want to have this sold by the end of summer. You know, right now, housing market is up. So it really would be a good time to sell. You know, heck, from what I understand, our neighbor's house sold for 45000 They wanted 48000 You know, and this, you know, it's a mobile home. So is ours. So is mine. But still, it's, you know, it's, it's, it's bigger. And I think the other one was a two-bedroom made into a three. Where this one here is a three-bedroom already. So, you know, and it's 70-footer. You know, 14 wide, you know, and so, but I think 30 is a good price, you know, because uh, when I'm done, it'll be ready to move in. You know, whoever gets it can move straight in. Now, look at this. So, but anyway, uh, what do y'all think about the channel name? Seriously, you know, and folks, I got to say this too. We, we, we got to get our minds and our hearts right, you know, mainly our mind because if, you know, if we get our mind right, our heart will, our heart will follow. So, you know, we, we need that forgiveness. You know, salvation is free, folks. You ain't got to pay for it. You know, and a lot of veterans I've spoke with said they don't know if they can get forgiveness. I don't care what you've done. You will get forgiveness. You know, if you was in the war... You know, and, you know, God understands war, you know. If you if you had to kill a thousand people in war, as long as you did it, you know, and it wasn't just cold-blooded murder, then, yeah, even if you committed murder, you, you can still be forgiven if you mean it when you ask for forgiveness, though. If you truly repent, you will get that mercy and forgiveness. You know, but don't be doing things thinking, well, I'll just ask forgiveness. I'll get it. It don't work that way. So, don't worry about that. But, uh, look at this, folks. Look how this goes down here, and it goes in, to right in here. See there? See there? So, I don't know, folks. Sure is a pretty night. Nice day. Nice evening. So, but, uh, anyway, folks, I just figured I'd get that off my chest, and, 
you know, talk to y'all about it and see what I should do. So, you know, about the channel and selling this place. You know, to be honest, I'm in Ohio and I want to go out west. You know what I mean? So, um, I don't know. I guess that's it for this evening, folks. And, you know, I thank y'all for watching. And remember, this channel name may go into Hillbilly Sky Watching with a different icon. The icon is a record. You know, it's like an old 33 and a half record. <laughs> you remember those? I remember eight tracks myself. You know, I remember getting in my dad's car, putting eight track tape in. And then I remember listening to reel to reel uh, um, tape players too. I got a few, uh, two or three reel to reel albums in the shed. But anyway, folks, um, I thank y'all for watching. Put Jesus first. And uh, there's that bright star again. Right in here. Let me show you here. I'll show it to you. There it is. There it is. Hey there. So, anyway, folks, again, for the third time, I thank you for watching. I love y'all. Much peace and love always. Skip you again, like right there. I'll show you again. Yeah, I'm right there. So, anyway, much love, everyone. I love y'all. God bless you, everyone. And put God first. Well, put Jesus first. We need to get love and kindness in our hearts. I mean, humankind is just becoming too wicked. You know, people just staying angry over everything or anything. Patience is the key. So, all right. I love you, everyone. God bless you, everybody. Thanks for watching. My next number update today.